that was quite challenging is, you know, at times finding hilarity just after tragedy. Lord of the Rings property is, of course, one of the my, most iconic still to this day. What was it about this show specifically, though, that interested you both in being a part of it? I think... Um, I think how universal it's proven to be, uh, Tolkien's work has proven to be. Um, and I think that, you know, the fact that we're able to to, to be a part of, of the series and it still be so kind of relevant thematically to the world that we live in, in in some way, regardless of it being set in a fantastical context, I think that that was really exciting. Um, you know, the, this his work had such an impact 20 years ago, many years before that and I think that it's just evident that it just continues to engage audiences and continues to um to to bring an, a new excitement and a hopefully a new generation will be able to enjoy it in the same way that that yeah I did growing up and many many other people did hmm. yeah I um I'm excited that um I just love, I'm excited by imagination and I love that this show has imagination to its extremities and you can really see a full range of emotion um, and I'm really excited that we get to kind of share that with people and people to experience the same stuff that we did when we were filming. Um, yeah. Were you two uh, fans of the novel uh, or well, the, the source material prior to joining the series or did you start to really dive in once you got to work on the show? Yeah, I didn't have any, um, any experience of Tolkien in my life before this show. So the show has really given me um, the time to literally literally be immersed in it um, and to learn so much about it not just from you know from like watching the movies and sort of um, understanding that context but also like from talking to the other cast members and the showrunners and we had a Tolkien expert on set um, who was great I could ask him anything and he would tell me the answer immediately um, no it was great I'm, I'm really glad that I have Tolkien in my life now I um, mean, yeah, I, I'd read the books when I was younger and um, they were a bit of a family favourite and same with the films. And it was a really, uh, it was a really surreal experience revisiting them in the context of filming, being a part of the series. So I think that was really exciting and, and yeah, very, very surreal. So what would you say then was uh, one of your biggest creative challenges coming into your role? Um, I think... I think kind of like any role that it always presents some challenges and I think it was just the showrunners had written such dynamic and the writers had written such dynamic characters with a lot of duality and um with duality and 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 complex arcs and and emotions and that they that they experience and go through and I think that that was something that was quite challenging is you know at times finding hilarity just after tragedy and and vice versa and I think that was that was quite difficult sometimes but that's with every role that that comes comes around and um and then also yeah just getting to really getting used to and and adjusting to wearing the the feet and the costumes and realizing actually how helpful that was and how much that really added and, and created and built the characters for it for me at least and I found that so to be so helpful and um, yeah, I was really, really glad. And I think, I think, yeah, I was very, that was kind of what was challenging. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> uh, even though this show is, is such a, you know, big title, uh, it, it, even a few months out, we're still having so much kept under wraps. What's that been like for you to having to sort of talk around a lot of the show as you, uh, you know, go around promoting it? Um, yeah, I mean, I think that's a pretty um, sort of like a standard procedure, I think, now, um, especially in the industry, is to sort of keep everything um, under wraps until it, uh, until it comes out. But also, like, I quite enjoy sort of not telling people anything. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think in, from the sense of, like, it means that they then get to just watch it and really experience that and explore the episodes and the sequence of events and I yeah because you know there's just so much adventure and so much fun that happens in it and it would just be such a shame to spoil it. Mm.